Hello there, Taurus. This is going to be reading for your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. And we're going to do a past life reading. So this is someone that you might already know in this lifetime or you didn't meet yet. But you have had previous lifetime or lifetime with. It could be several, could be one. But for some reason you're coming back together in this lifetime. And let's see what we can find out about that. Okay, let's see. Who is this person? We have... The Two of Wands, Justice, and the Tower. Ooh. And the Knight of Cups. Okay, so Justice is Libra energy. The Tower could be Aries or Scorpio. And then the Knight of Cups is um, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. So it looks like you were on the path together here. You, you chose to be together. And there's Justice here. And so things were balanced out, and then something happened. Something happened in your life where everything sort of fell apart. Their tower came in. So something broke you up or something happened. Let's see what you have here. Why do we have the two of wands? This is also a choice, a decision. Maybe someone decided to leave. We do have the Knight of Cups here. Okay, let's see. Let's get into this. Why do we have the two of wands here? Okay. This was a burden. This... Okay, <clears throat> this bird. It, you know, I'm looking at these two birds <clears throat> together, and they look like they're working together, like they're very happy together. So why was this a burden? Maybe they weren't allowed to be together. Why is the justice card here? Why is the justice card here? Ooh. Wow. So anxiety, a lot of sleepless nights, trying to make things fair. Okay, well, and then the tower came in. Why did the tower come in? What is this all about? Ooh, some sneaky energy here. Someone did something that brought this tower down, that brought this ending to this relationship. But there's love here. Someone wanted to come back in. And we have the King of Pentacles. So this is, could be your energy. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. Let me see if I could get some more from the guides here. Was that there was a very strong connection, but it was a burden for some reason. I don't think you guys were allowed to be together. Someone broke you up. You want you both wanted to be together with each other. And there was someone that did something here to you. This was interference. This was someone that came in between you. Wow. Okay. Yeah, I think it was outside interference that broke you up for some reason. Okay. Why are you together in this lifetime? Knight of Swords. The Fool. And we have the Empress. Okay, so this could be you, the Empress, Taurus, or it could be Libra. Now we have Libra here and we have Libra and Taurus here. So with this, we have uh, Libra, Aquarius, and Gemini, and Aquarius and Aries here. So you're together to start something new again, to, to start some, a new beginning. And swiftly, this should be happening. And this is also like you're together. I feel like this with this energy, I feel like, you know, want to use the curl, want to use the horse here. And that you're together, working together, but not, but able to be apart. It almost feels like you're working on the same thing. Whoever you are, you're working on the same thing, but you're not working together. And there's choices here. Okay. Decisions to be made. This almost feels like there's other... I keep on feeling other people involved in this lifetime too. There's other people involved. Th these might be like temptations. I'm feeling like there are temptations here for somebody. Okay, why is the Knight of Swords here? King of Cups. A lot of emotions here. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. And why is the Fool card here? The world. Starting over. Bringing something together. A new beginning. This is definitely a new beginning from something that ended. 
You're meant to be together. You're meant to re redo this. Re almost like have another chance here. That's why I feel like this is another shot for whatever happened here. Because you guys were meant to be together. And something broke you up. So why is the Seven of Cups here? Here we have a Seven of whether or not someone's trying to make up their mind now if they want to put any work into this situation here because of, uh, this is again interference i'm feeling okay the hermit someone's gone into hermit mode virgo energy saying i don't i can't even deal with this it's too much confusion that's why i feel very confused someone feels confused to me whom are you to each other Every time I see this card, I feel like there's a deep connection in many lifetimes here. I'm trying to ba you balance each other out. Wow, another two. Decision. And we have the Knight of Wands. There's a lot of passion here. Again, we have separate but together. The bird and this horse are together. This bird is not on the horse. They're together and they have a lot of passion and they work well together. But there's something about someone's not making... There's a stalemate here. Someone's not making a decision. But you guys belong together. And we have the hermit again. I think you're both in hermit mode. You're both doing your own thing at this time. You need to be together, but you're both... Um, this is Virgo energy. You could be dealing with a Virgo. Trying to find your way. You're both, I think... You know, you guys might have been together already in this lifetime. You're in separation because you both have to find out what you're supposed to do. And then you could come together. You needed to separate. Okay, now why is the two of pentacles here? A new beginning. The fool card. Now, isn't that what we had here? Yeah, but the fool. You're definitely going to start something. You're on your own, but you're, you're going to be together. You need to connect here. This is Aries Aquarius. Why is the two of swords here? Someone cannot make up their mind what to do. They are stuck in their head here. They're not, there's no, there's a stalemate here. There's a two of, of swords because I think, I feel like this is both of your energies. You both feel stuck. Neither one wants to make a move. You're both in the hermit mode. Now, well, what about the knight of wands? Why is the knight of wands here? Empress. Okay. Your energy, Libra energy. Now, well, we had that already. But, um, so, I think someone's the Knight of Wands in this situation. Someone's the Empress. So, and this is Taurus and Libra, so this very well could be you. Someone's putting someone on a pedestal, and someone's a little more, see, someone's a little more grounded, a little more creative, a little more able to create what they want. And then there's an energy that's a little more flighty, a little more, um, impulsive. So whichever way that resonates with you guys. And then we have the King of Wands here. A lot of passion though. There's a lot of passion. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Okay, let me... um. Got two, a King of Cups, a King of Wands. A lot of love and passion between you guys. Okay, let's see. What are your feelings towards them? Two of Cups, Soulmate Connection. Another two. Justice wants balance. I see the scales as two of two. I'm getting very strong two of... And look at this. You want a connection here. You want justice. And you also want um, an opportunity here or to bring something in or to offer them something. And it's not going to be small, something big. You want to celebrate. You want to go out. Okay, why do we have the Two of Cups here? Why is the Two of Cups here? The Sun. This connection makes you really happy. Whether you met them or not yet. If you know them, you know this, this connection is makes you really happy. Leo and she could be dealing with a Leo. Um, yeah, so why is the Justice card here? Choices. You feel like they have choices. And you're not sure if that you'll be a choice here. 
You want justice, though. You want justice with this person. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? Knight of Pentacles. Well, you are the Earth sign. Maybe you want to go towards them. I'm going to offer here with the, the, the Ace of Pentacles. Or you want them to come towards you. Here's the Hermit again. Again, you see them as in Hermit mode. As being by themselves. As, you know, doing their own thing. Seeking their own truth. But either you want them to come towards you. I'm going to offer very slow. But this, it feels more like your energy. You want to go towards them with an offer but you're taking your time slow and steady here okay i want to make sure you do it correctly okay but you know if you have to reverse it reverse it because it's not going to be the same for everyone what are their feelings towards you Ooh, shock of evils of change unexpected Beginning, a new beginning. They want a new beginning. This might shock you. or But they're afraid of being left out in the cold, abandoned. They're not sure about this, so this is shocking. And we do have, okay, they don't want to fight, argue. Um, they're feeling that that's not might what happened. Or there's, there's other people involved. They don't want other people to be involved. you got five here and five here. Those are changes. Okay, and we have change here for the... So there's definitely change. They, they see this as some kind of change coming in here. So no matter what happens, there's going to be a change. Is what I'm feeling. Okay, what about this tower? Why is the tower here for their feelings towards you? Uh, they've been through a lot. They don't want to... They don't want to go through any more. They don't... I feel like they don't know what to expect with you. And they've been through a lot. In this relationship and they don't want to they've been they they already done a lot they don't want to do any more that's why i feel like they're done so um why is the fool but they do want a new beginning so why is the fool here two of cups yeah because they see you as two of cups too they see you as a soulmate connection they would like a new beginning they're just afraid okay what about this five of pentacles why is the five of pentacles here the hierophant that's you Taurus. they see long-term commitment but they're afraid that it won't work they're afraid of being left out page of pentacles but i think they might want to make an offer here too Taurus, virgo capricorn they would like to maybe that or maybe they're willing to start small you know not to jump into anything just to see a little communication okay let's see here what signs can we be dealing with for Taurus? Sagittarius. Capricorn. Cancer. Scorpio. Virgo. And Aquarius. So we have Sagittarius, Capricorn, Cancer, Scorpio, Virgo, and Aquarius. These are the signs you could be dealing with. You could be dealing with any sign. These could be placements in your chart. This could be placements in their chart. If you don't see the sign, doesn't mean the person's not here. And also, you might not have met this person yet. If you already know this person, you'll know. It does not feel right to you. And that could be because you did not meet them yet. All right, guys. If this resonates at all, let me know. If it feels just kind of like it might. You know, that could be too. It could be like your your guys are telling you, yeah, you just haven't gotten there yet. You know, you don't know it yet. Okay, so um but if you like this reading, please give me a thumbs up. I appreciate all your likes, shares, and subscribes. And I hope to see you again real soon. Thank you so much.